Oh no! We discovered that the curse of Lot was caused by the mayor accidentally exchanging his daughter for the town's happiness. That is very bad, and I will not stand for it. I mean, if everyone else is also not standing for it. And now, a pack of rioting gnomes is at Town Hall. I'm sure Chip, Jay, and I, Gillian Tidestrider, will solve this easily and nothing will go wrong. But there's always a chance. We'll just have to roll with it. Welcome back to this roll with it. Today we're gonna be playing D and D. I'm Who's Grizzly, left? and I'm your DM. I'm Bisley, and I uh, I play I play Ch Chip. Chip. Very brave of you. I'm 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 Condi, and I play um. I, I play Jay Farron. Halt! Who go- Stop! Huh? I'm Charlie Sl- Huh? Uh, I play I'm Gillian Tidestripe- let, let me deal with this. Goodbye. Uh. Uh. Ah. Ooh. Oh. E. Oh. Ah. How was that? Was that any good? Oh. Was that good? I didn't realize that that song was the song used for that meme, and now I have to take it off the play. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, and I'm Charlie, otherwise known as Slime Skull. I play Gillian Tidestrider. Last we left off, the three of you, Chip, Jay, and Gillian, swam through the Royal Ocean after blowing up your boat, arriving on the island of Luff and Lot. You discovered that the <laughs> town on this island, Mornstead, was full of people stuck in a state of forced laughter and joy. Gillian then found that he could cure this like a disease, but only before it entered its final stage, which you experienced first with the woman in Old Man Oral's tavern, and second, just outside the tavern, against old bald men gone mad. After this struggle, a battle with the highest stakes of your entire lives collectively, you were met with Mayor Roland Laughlin. Noticing you were all seemingly capable and looking a bit worn out and desperate, he requested to speak to you all privately at Town Hall the next day. Despite your suspicions, and with the motivation of a promised reward if helped, you agreed to meet him, and proceeded to rest for the night. However, through your night's rest, something took a hold of all of you. Oh shit, yeah. <laughs> oh fuck, I forgot. <laughs> Jay was tormented by repeating night terrors stemming from problems of her past. Oh. Gillian woke up as a broken version of himself, self, feeling doubtful and depressed. And Chip awoke with an aggressive, uncontrollable tremor in his hands. On your way out, Gillian freed old man Oro from his shackles of euphoria, and with an ill feeling churning in your stomach, you made your way to Town Hall. Once inside, you freed another person, this time the lovely receptionist, and then entered the mayor's office. During this meeting, you learned that Mayor Roland, with good intentions, made a deal with a mysterious, mystical man deep in the woods of this island, a transaction of something equal, of equal importance to the mayor for the prosperity of the town. However, your meeting was cut short as your questions were interrupted by the sound of a large wooden door is being bursted open from outside this office. Gillian and Chip crash through the closed window, leaving Jay behind with the mayor. <laughs> As you two turn the corner of the building, you found a large group of gnomes dressed in black leathers gathered at the entrance. You heard one of them shout, and that is where we pick back up, baby! Woo! Okay. Woo! So... As you two are approaching this group, you see one of these gnomes, only slightly taller than the rest, stack, stack a few crates uh, you know, with help from the people around him and, and climb on top of them. He raises a torch stick above his glistening, slick, black pompadour, and his baby blue eyes enthrall the crowd that he leads. 
Okay. No. He turns to face the door and shouts that you heard at the end of last session. Get out here, man. <laughs> you're not going to be walking in no more. <laughs> Jay, you're still with the mayor. And you guys are running up to this crowd. Uh, as okay. you are running up, uh, you guys see that some of the townsfolk have actually trailed this group as they, as they has wa walked their way down the street uh, and are forming a crowd a little bit of ways away from their group. Just watching it. Uh huh. Others are exiting okay. buildings nearby or peeking their heads through the windows to see the commotion. And the group of gnomes all have an assortment of weapons and destructive devices, such oh, as pitchforks, <laughs> oh shovels, God. molotovs, torch sticks, etc. Uh, the gnome that has climbed up onto uh, the top of the crates. As the doors you have seen have been just bursted open, splintering some of the wood. He, he looks inside and he says... That's a natural... <laughs> he looks inside and he says... Hey, get out of here, gorgeous. You don't want to be caught in the crossfire. And then he <laughs> lights his torch above his head. And... You can see now, as you guys are getting closer to this group, he's actually talking to the receptionist that you had cured earlier. Hmm. You see uh, her face, you just get a glimpse as she as she quickly scurries from out behind the desk. Uh, she looks fearful, and he takes notice of this because as he turns around to face the crowd, he does a double take and he says, Wait a second. <laughs> How are you like that? And she just runs off. Okay, yeah, Chip, you see Gillian start to raise his hand. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I want to immediately pull it down and say, Girl? Can we please stay out of this one? <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Okay. <laughs> Chip, um, do you I'm have in any the office? Oh, do you have any scheme for this? Um Okay. Leather guys, uh fire, may no. Lots of sharp things. <laughs> Run, could you maybe. just take could you just steal all their things so they don't have them anymore? That's a lot of things, Gil. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to steal that many. Thought you were a pirate. Well, I'm I am a pirate! Pirates are supposed to plunder, I thought. Yeah, I mean, I... I... Not this time! You guys see the gnome on top of the crates raise and, and pump the torch up twice and you hear him go, <laughs> The mayor has stepped over this town for too long! Another one bites the dust every sunrise! We got friends and family <laughs> going mad. <clears throat> I want to. Oh, this laughter. Oh, yes. And you hear, you hear the, the, the gnomes in front of them aren't laughing, but the crowd behind a little bit of way, ways away and the people who are, are looking through the windows, they're still chuckling. They're still laughing. They still mm -hmm. look like they're stuck. But this group of gnomes, they're all eyes furrowed and, and, and anger. And he says, oh, this laughter. But not a single one of you happy. We will get on the name of my book of family, Retribution. You know, Chip, he does have a pretty good point. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, Gil, I got a plan. I wanna, I wanna step oh, forward okay. and just kind of like, just follow my lead. And I wanna, I wanna step oh, forward right. and kind of go, yeah, down with the mayor. Yes, down with yes! the man. I wanna, I wanna like try and, try and uh, bolster the crowd more. <laughs> You're crazy. Go up, go up <laughs> next to, next to that, uh, next to that guy and I want to stand up next to him. I want to put my arm around him. For too long, this town has been stepped on. And, yes. And, and, uh, <laughs> and what, what else happened? And yes, everyone's we have laughing been, we have and been that's a downtrodden. Bad thing. We cannot downtrodden. allow this to go on. We must strike <laughs> with haste against this villain. Yes. All right, so <laughs> roll, <laughs> me... Chip, roll a persuasion check with advantage, and while you're doing that, Jay, what are you going to do as this has happened? Okay, as I, happens. They, so they just jumped out the window for me. I'm like, oh god, what the yep. fuck is going on in here? I'm getting um, unironically into it. <laughs> you look, you look over. You see the the mayor is wide eyed, and then he quickly scurries underneath his desk. Yeah, you okay. hide. Maybe actually, maybe jump out the window too and like run the That's opposite it. direction. Don't they want even... to go out there. Yeah, okay, fine. Oh, I recognize my God. that voice. I, I hear them yelling outside. I hear Chip yelling, bolstering the crowd. <laughs> yeah, like, you do. Oh, my God. <laughs> that's what a, the that's fuck are they doing? 14, and with that, I want to <laughs> I wanna yell, Yeah, and I'm pretty sure I saw him making, making a break for it for the ocean. <laughs> okay, you roll with advantage, right? Yes, that was 14 with advantage. Alrighty. Uh, Jake, go on. Okay. Um, yeah, you stay, you know, I'll 
deal with this. Um, and I, I start walking towards the front door, I guess. I'm just kind of like, oh, God, oh, God, what do I do? Um, Join our revolution, Jay. <laughs> with, a, with a torch, and I'm, like, screaming at the crowd. Like, I'm I, up there with them. I, I walk in front of, like, I am surrounded by the double door there. You know, like, I, it is, like, a, a framing mm -hmm. for me. And it mm -hmm. just kind of zooms in on me. I'm like, what the hell is going on here? <laughs> we are seizing back the means of production, Jay. No, you're not. <laughs> what the hell? You're doing an uprising against the... He's not even in there right now, for God's sake. Jesus, oh. you try to help a town once. Holy shit. Okay, everybody listen up. Everybody. I pulled a, I pulled a metal. A metal out of my pocket. My name is Jay Farron of the Navy. We're gonna we're gonna spread out. Everybody, get the fuck away from here, right now. But what about our revolution? <laughs> Not today, Kill. Jay, I'm trying to help you, people. Okay. Roll an intimidation check. Okay. What the fuck is that? That's a natural twenty. <laughs> oh my god. How <laughs> are you dead? Damn. <laughs> I didn't think that would work. <laughs> Me neither, to be honest. <laughs> Chip, you, you walk over uh, and you start trying to lift the crowd and become part of this uh, this group. Obviously, uh, as you guys get closer, you start uh, yelling out these, these things about the mayor. Uh, the one that's on top of the crates who's giving this uh, sort of uh, motivational or inspirational hoorah to the, to the, the people, the gnomes that he leads. Uh, he sees you two walk up and he's like, Man, I don't know. I don't know. And then, uh, I don't know, you guys. And then uh, as a... As, uh, as you are trying to get his attention, Jay comes from uh, the entrance of Town Hall and starts yelling, Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> You're all more. Get off my lawn! Get off my lawn! Kids. Basically, <laughs> basically uh, coming to this doorway uh, and and pulling out a, a you know a police badge and and that that's what you're essentially trying to do, right? With this, uh, yes, with this I'm intimidation, trying to, I'm trying to like. Do a show the, of authority, kind the of. The way, deal. yeah, the, the way that it sounds is, is you're trying. To, are you trying to scare them off? Yes, totally. Okay, or at you least see calm them down to the point where I can explain further. At the very least, is my goal. Okay, the gnomes themselves, the 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 group, uh, after you yelled this out, which echoes throughout the uh, the town um, and your area, uh, the one that is on top of the crates, he turns around and slowly looks at you, and you can see. He goes, <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait a minute, I, I know you, and he looks a little shaken up now that you have mentioned yeah. uh, being a part of the Navy. Yeah, we met at the tavern. So this mean it's true? <laughs> Man's working with the Navy after all. <laughs> no, not, he's he not working with the Navy, we're just here to help, we heard rumors of, of, just bad shit happening here. And obviously they're true. We're here to try to stop it. We can we can cure the disease, actually. Gil, Gil, you can cure the disease. Show them. I'm just chilling here. <laughs> and I like, kick him forward into the crowd with everyone watching around him. <laughs> okay. Come on, Gil, this is like... Um, Come on, you got it. Just do trying to thing. stop a violent insurrection here, Gil. I tried a second. Guys, I'm nervous. <laughs> I don't think it's coming out. No, buddy, you got it, you got it. Oh my god. No, I I'm having I'm having trouble with everyone's okay. watching. I can't He's get it out. He's a little shy. He's a little but he can He's, do it. He can. I've he, seen him do he it. He can. I've done it before. He did lots it to the receptionist. Before. The lady, she just ran away. Oh no. <laughs> no, no. I, and he looks he uh he looks back at, at the group and he says and he makes a hand motion that just kind of uh Now hold on a second. These are uh, these are obstacles I did not account for in the plan, everyone. Just <laughs> back up a minute. He looks at you, Jay. Stop <laughs> walking here. <laughs> All right, we don't. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, we're just, we're just walking here. This is between. Yeah, you better be walking somewhere else here in a fucking moment. <laughs> you don't understand. This is between me. I mean, I mean, this is between the town and the mayor. We don't want to. There's no okay. reason to get the. So what's he been doing with me. the navy? What did, what did the what did the mayor do? I mean, he's the cause of the of this of this disease. I suppose he he didn't know that. 
I guess all the gnomes are immune. So for, I mean, I, I, I heard him. I, sp spring him out here because I heard him. Hmm. I overheard him. He, he, he goes into the forest. At least every week, maybe twice. He disappears. I tried to follow him, but I lost sight of him at one point. <laughs> he was walking here. <laughs> God damn it, man. <laughs> at some point, he returned and. It's just, it's too coincidental. I know he's got something to do with it, and people are dying, and he hasn't done anything about that. He doesn't even acknowledge it. I don't want to fight someone that's connected to the Navy. Listen. And but I if don't he's not going to pay, somebody has to fix this. Well, Where is he anyways? <sighs> Well, he's not in his office anymore, that's for sure. <laughs> he ran somewhere. Look, there's even a hole in the glass. It's fucking dead. He jumped out a window. Listen, listen. Oh, just give us some time, okay? We, we, we can fix it. We can fix it. That, that's why we're here. We're here to fix the problem. We can? Yes. 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 We can. We can. We... <laughs> why are you so shaky still? Stop, stop. Make, 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 as uh, as as you're saying this, um, the mayor actually steps uh, out from around the hallway and um, <laughs> just sort of raises just, a hand just, behind you. Turn to him and I'm like stare wide eyed. I'm like, <laughs> it's all right, <laughs> Julian. He speaks out towards the gnome. I can see that you and your... He looks behind his shoulder. Group. Have a lot of qu questions and... I can't safely give and haven't been able to give all the answers. But these three... They're the key... They're a glimmer of hope. I believe they are the solution <laughs> to this town's curse that has fallen upon it. Ah, uh, Gillian. Chip, do you guys do anything? I'm stepping back from that motherfucker so I don't get set on fire. <laughs> Bro, I'm just <laughs> awkward. <laughs> <laughs> DM made me awkward, so I'm awkward now. <laughs> <laughs> just, you know, just whatever. I, I'm still kind of in awe. Can I, like, have a reaction set up in case they try to attack him to, like, pull him out of the way? <laughs> well, as, as you, you... When you came out and yelled mm -hmm. and, and basically pulled pulled out the, the, the medal that is clearly uh, given to heroes of the Navy, mm -hmm. um, everyone, especially the, the person who seemed to have been leading... Uh, who you just heard, is, his name is Julian. Um, they look not, ex they look shooken up uh, to the point where the, the, the morale, especially in Julian, uh, and especially with that check, <laughs> has almost been completely crushed by just your appearance uh, and what you have yelled. So there's no, uh, while the, the tension is, is obviously there, the hostility has, at least for, for the moment, been backpedaled. Okay. You do Jay's have kinda, all of their attention. Yeah, Jay is kind of like breathing a little bit heavily. She did not think that was going to work. <laughs> um, <laughs> hear the I give Jay a little, I give Jay a little say some shit nudge. <laughs> like, well, um, I, um, um, okay, okay. Well, I have everybody's attention. Okay, good. Listen, listen. There's a man in, in a hut in a forest, and he is the one who caused all this, not the mayor. It was... He he had good intentions, you know? He wanted to help everybody. He, he lost his daughter because of it. <laughs> We're... Wait. Julian speaks up. What What's this about Abigail? Is that true? I just kind of look towards the mayor. The mayor looks at you 
gives you a slight nod and looks back towards Julian and says, I know you two were close. And while I haven't been forthright of her whereabouts, and I haven't had an immediate solution to the predicament we are faced with, I can assure you, now that I have a possible answer, and then he uh, eyes a Chip and Gillian, and then looks back at Jay. Listen, he's lost a lot. It seems like everybody here has lost a lot, and I understand how you feel, obviously. You know, it's not easy being being diseased like this and feeling nothing but joy and happiness. I mean, that sounds really great on the outside, actually, but regardless, you know, it's not uncurable. There's other answers. You don't need to resort to violence. It's, it's not the only answer. We can help. Yeah. Yeah. What she, what she <laughs> said. Jillian looks down to you two. Well, whose side are you on anyways? I don't know, man. <laughs> Who's winning? <laughs> what? Shit, not us. It's about yours. So what's this? About a man in the forest? Is that who you keep going and talk to? He points over to the mayor. Yes, I... Uh, and then he looks back at you, Jay. I have tried to reconvene multiple times. Beg for a way out. It's a, a different deal. Unfortunately, it's usually to no avail. But I have been trying. I swear it. I swear it on my, on my daughter's life. These three were capable. I don't know where they came from. We beat up some bald people. We're pretty awesome. <laughs> but it must be fate that they're here. I'm confident they can help Julian. So, let's just not um, 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 destroy this structure. <laughs> or me. <laughs> And he, he sweats a little bit. <laughs> All right, then. Eh? Um, but I still don't trust you. So you just got to go talk to the... The... the mizzle dizzle in the forest sizzle. Something like that. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> Some strange way to put it. I will adopt this slag. I mean, yeah, hopefully we can resolve it just by talking to him. But it's, there's no guarantees, obviously. Uh, some we'll of the people him. <laughs> some of the people behind uh in this group of gnomes you hear one from pipe up and go but what about our revenge and the other one's like down with the mayor julian turns back around uh towards him he's like wait new plan <laughs> i go with the mayor and these three into this forest and meet this man not towards Jim. Oh, yes. It's like wide-eyed, <laughs> vibrating. If the story checks out, well then, all's well that ends well. <laughs> but if he's a liar and turns out to be that greedy son of a bitch, well then we'll get, we'll get what's mine. My people will find your people and we'll be just like this. Same thing next week. Meet back here. Same time. <laughs> Sounds like reconvene. I don't, I don't, that makes I don't sense. Plan on being here that long. Us versus you. <laughs> Probably won't fire. Yeah, you know, it's, yeah, sure. Fire sounds cool. I, you know, if he's lying, I mean, I'm not. You know, it's, I'm, we might be busy that day. <laughs> we, we really. Yeah, whatever. Okay, yeah, anyway. <laughs> hut, hut and forest. That's. That, that's where the solution to our problems lies, okay? I don't think this guy can do anything about it. Look at him. He's shaking. He's trembling. He's he's more shaking than fucking Chip is. My god. 
<laughs> are you pointing? Are you pointing to the mayor? You say yes. this. He's just he's just vibrating. Mm, so shaky. <laughs> However, I can lead you to the last place I sp spoke with him. And after, and hopefully you will find a way to deal with him. Does a little yeah. hand motion near the neck. <laughs> Awesome. We wi What do you- what? <laughs> what? What is wrong with your hand? He looks a little, a little hesitant at um, Julian's proclaim to uh, come with you. But Julian hops off the crate and snuffs out the torch and, and walks up towards you, Jay, and the mayor. All right, so where do we go? I, I look towards the mayor. I'm like, yeah, where do we go? You said north, right? Right. Northwards. <laughs> Just behind. Um, and as you are, are looking, uh, because I, I sort of neglected the the, the scene here. Um, mm -hmm. The town hall itself is this a square building of of limestone, uh, with a few steps that lead to the large doors that have been bursted open. Mm -hmm. um, and it wears the forest behind it like a like a coat, like the woodland wraps around this building and and uh, sort of bleeds into the front area uh, where you guys are. So the end, you have like basically two entrances and in, into this north woods, uh, the opposite of end of where you guys came from, which was the south woods. Mm -hmm. Yes, um, deep into the north woods behind behind town hall. That's where I found him. So whenever you're ready, uh, put we the are ready down, now. please. Uh, you see the the, the group of uh, of, uh, of gnomes look confused and but willing to because because of what Julian has said. And he goes, "Head back to the you know the place, and I'll be back hopefully. If not, <laughs> you know, seven days or so might want to hold a funeral or something." <laughs> if I'm not, we'll get what's right. I promise. And there's kind of like a, a resounding agreement within that group as they uh, simmer down and start heading back the road. The people now that have been watching this commotion, uh, they still seem, again, joyful, but they all disperse as well. Whew! <sighs> all right, glad I could solve that one. Hey, um... Have fun in the forest. Let me know how it goes. You're uh, coming with us, Chip. <laughs> All right. Just... <laughs> oh, you can't. You cannot weasel out of this one now, Chip. You want me to? Yeah. And we're going now? Yeah. Why not? That's super. <laughs> That's I just, just have like a very. Stuff. <laughs> um, you lead the way, Mayor. Can I? Um, can we? Can we just the three of? Can we do the? Can we speak? Oh Everyone in these <laughs> hand motions. <laughs> um, uh, take as much time as you'd like. Hey guys, Charlie Slimesicle here. Welcome to the mid roll. This is the part where we put all of our sponsors supporting the show. <gasps> Patreon! Is that a sponsor? That's right. We don't have any sponsors. We're only oh. alive thanks to our Patreon. You got it right, Grizz. What's up, guys? It's me, Grizz, here, and I just got back from living underneath the bridge on the street in the city. But now that I have, uh, we have just now currently hit 520 patrons, I can finally afford a tent. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, Grizzly. Um, guys, if you want to see him get upgraded to a big plastic box make sure to head on over to the patreon patreon.com slash just roll with it we actually have some really incredible stuff over there slash just roll with it ow chris what do we what have over stuff, there what kind of stuff do we have over there you, you know, what's going on tent, tent uh, man tent man you're, last you're time dirt. why are you so stinky in the studio? Uh, you're so dirty last time i visited From the library and got into the computer using my uh, friend's library card <laughs> that i found in the sewers, I saw that we have concept art for characters. We have, oh wait, 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 that's not even the coolest part. The coolest part is that we have a second campaign over there run by Bisley. 
We he's do. making it so is, much money. It is called, it is called, just <laughs> roll with it, Prime Defenders. It's a superhero campaign. You sure could use a superhero, couldn't you, Grizz? Yes. And if you want to be my superhero, you could pledge to the Patreon slash dot com. I mean, dot com slash just roll, roll with it. Just roll with it. We're just going to roll with it. Go on over there, guys. Uh, in the first tier for only $5 a month, you can get access to that incredible campaign. We've already got a couple episodes out, and I am fucking thrilled to keep playing in it. I'm playing William Wisp, uh, a, a, a kid that is has the powers of a will-o'-wisp and, and, and solves mysteries. Uh, oh, oh, uh, I'm, I'm playing when I- <laughs> And Grizzly's homeless! When I'm so much! <laughs> Whenever I can afford, I play Dakota Go. Listen, okay? The bug bites are getting intensive, man. Please just pledge to Patreon. Like Grizzly so that looks I can... like one big welt, so please go over to Patreon. He's just a sad red lump in the ground under I'm buying, <laughs> I'm buying cortisone by the buckets. How can he afford it? I don't know. He spends all of his money on cortisone. I'm so itchy. Yes, sure. I put away that metal at this point and like tuck into my pocket. And she kind of looks a little bit sad and like and she didn't want to use that. Well, but you know. You walk oh, away from the mirror well, and Julian who are just incredibly Sorry, confusing, but now we finally have something comprehensible. We will go to the woods, we will find the magic trickster. We will hurl him off a large ledge. Mm -hmm. And the yes. balance will be restored. And the balance is all fine. Everything's back as it should be in this island, you know? Okay, and yeah, yeah. We're happy, that's, they're that's happy. That's all well and good, but... I mean... Yeah. This is not our problem. Not only are we are we just taking on other people's problems, but we're not solving my problem. I don't have a ship! Yeah, I mean, I'm a you pirate know, with no ship! We are and, and pirates with no ship, okay? This so it's really not just it's solve just not just anything you. here. Currently, yeah, we have a place to stay. These people are the one with the more pressing problem. We're not you know, dying once, of I, laughter I, every night. I I really agree with Gil for once. Actually, yes, yes, it is very good. <laughs> um, Guys, listen, I mean, you know, I have we, a, as much sympathy as, as, as the rest of you, but I just. I just don't see why we're going to all this trouble when, I mean, they, they seem capable on their own. Uh, I, I don't know, are you forgetting, are you forgetting- Again, the, they are the dying giant, every night. The giant cash reward we were offered for solving this problem? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, sweet, all right, yeah, let's go. Uh, <laughs> another thing, Jay, what was I'm up I'm so that? glad you have seen the moral light. <laughs> what was up with that metal? That was a good play. You know, I wish I had thought yeah, of that yeah, one. What'd you yeah. get? Um, oh, you know, it's... Can I see uh, it? I want to just reach in and grab uh, it no, out. No, like, no, no, no. I, I, uh, I grab his hand as wanna, he reaches into my pocket. I want to slide a hand the shit out of it. <laughs> oh, no. Roll. Uh, this would be slide a hand against perception, right? So. Uh, so your slide a hand against... Yeah. 13. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, 10. <laughs> as, I'm, as I'm saying that, I kind of like move my hand over towards the left and reach my other hand in to grab it, to kind of like grab grab her attention for a sec. And I just kind of, I want to inspect this uh, this metal. Right this in front of her? Is, yeah, this thing is real. This, I want to bite it. Yeah, yeah, it's real, it's real. Uh, can I have that back? <laughs> yeah, I mean. To you, it just looks like a, um, a, like a tapered, you know, triangle shaped ribbon, uh, colors of you know, the navy, red, white, gold, and oh. uh, attached to it is a, a medallion in the shape of a star. Well, whatever it is, it clearly commands respect. Yeah, it, yes. it's... Where'd you get it? Did you take, did you take this <laughs> off one of the navy guys? No, 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 I didn't take it from a navy guy. Oh, please, just give it back to me, please. That's all I have, okay? You got, got a lot of other stuff. No, that's... <laughs> Japan J back the metal. It is very important to her. Thank you, Gil. Okay. Uh, why? It's... It's a long story, okay? I'm just... It's... It's my sisters, alright? Um... 
It's you have a sister? <laughs> had. Oh, oh. Bruh, this is awkward. I'm gonna take the fucking. <laughs> I'm gonna take the medal from Chip and give it back to. Uh, I gave it back to her. To Jack. Oh, yeah, you did? I, I grab. Yes. I grab it. And oh, then, okay. Like, okay. Shove it back in my pocket. <laughs> the safety of my pocket. Yeah. No, I don't. I don't like no, talking no. about it. Hey, hey, you know my bad. Obviously. Mm-hmm. Anything by him. So. It's okay. Gillian, roll a uh, perception check. I can perceive that this is uncomfortable. <laughs> I got five, dude! <laughs> Jesus no. Christ! Gillian strikes again! Gillian. Actually, actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> the, the awkwardness of this exchange uh, <laughs> clouds your vision. <laughs> <laughs> I also am sad sometimes. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to laugh at you. <laughs> Listen, I'd, I'd rather not talk about it too, too much right now. No, no, no. It, it, Let us know, resolve these village's um, problems, and and then we may resolve our own. If you're wondering, though, I'm not part of the navy. No, that's that would well, be a little bit I insane. If you were you know, part I, of the navy, then what we did back on zero might have been a problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you think? You know, uh, I'm sure I'm on some sh shit lists. You know, there's some people who'd be very proud of me. <laughs> uh. Well, let's go get that cash reward. I mean, save the town. Yeah. <laughs> That's what matters here. All right. Uh, you guys head back towards the the entrance to meet up with the mayor and, and Julian. Uh, when you just see them, like, literally just standing next to each other, but heads are just facing the opposite direction as Julian taps his foot and the mayor looks visibly uncomfortable. Uh, this and he is goes, also a very awkward situation. <laughs> <laughs> and Julian goes, ah, hey, hey, are we getting out of here? Yeah, yeah. all good. Let's, uh, yes, you go we are ready to all right. kill the, the trick wizard. All right, he uh, he hits the, the mayor in the back of the ass with the, the stick, of the torch stick, uh, and he goes, <laughs> all right, <laughs> this way. Keep an eye out as well as we walk through the woodlands and most of the creatures have been friendly recently but yeah yeah sure you, you never um, can ever be too worry. safe hey anybody got any snacks i'm feeling a little snacky maybe uh some grope chips grope you got grope you got grope oh i actually had yeah i have some i have some potato chips in my bag actually always have like one on me i got them at zero here <laughs> sure yeah, uh, yeah, hey yeah. hey do you want some do you want some chip skill <laughs> what <laughs> why would I? Why would I devour our poor friend? What do you mean? They're just, you know, just. Why six. do you share? Are you of the same family? What? <laughs> what? They are called. Just, you just are. Eat the chips. I'm going. Just okay. The They're just. just Very the slowly chips, and cautiously. I want to. Why wanna would you eat chip? What? Oh god, what that I was done? my brother, Gil! What have I done? Oh Gil! I repent. I'm go I'm on my knees. Oh my god. I'm on my hands and knees. How could you do this to me, I'm Gil? I'm gonna throw it up. I'm gonna my throw brother. it up. What have I done? Nah, I'm just fucking You're with you. Your poor baby, on, baby, baby boy. No, hey, hey, just fuck with me. Come on, let's go. I have sinned. No, you're you're good. Not my brother. Potato-based snack. Very different. <laughs> I just want to walk through the woods, just like crunching these chips really loudly. Oh, that was your cousin. Oh, so you're definitely, you're definitely not being stealthy. Good no. to know. Alrighty. Uh... <laughs> I'm just like sure looking not. around. I'm looking around obliviously, like like with a <laughs> smile on my face. My tune has changed. Still a little. You shaky. remember the money <laughs> eating the chips? Yeah. Just like the freshwater shrimp eats its own young. So. The circle of life. Did you look that up? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you all follow the mayor. Uh, Julian hangs back towards whoever's in the back. Um, where are you guys positioned at the moment? As the mayor leads the direction. I'm, uh, probably I'm hanging out with front. Julian. I want to I wanna ask him. I want to talk to him a little bit. I want to talk to the mayor. <laughs> All right, so yeah, you guys uh, enter uh, the the North Woods. Um, 
and uh, everything is you know similar to the, the woods the woodlands that you've already traversed through to get to the town uh, except a thin layer of mist lingers on the floors of this forest so jay you're up uh in the in the front with the mayor mm -hmm. uh chip you're in the back would that's where mm -hmm. i'd be like i would be buddied up with julian i would be in the usually i'd be in the front i'll be in the middle now mm. okay yeah. so well they're all paired up all right i'll say uh you two um you want to do some some talking yeah, yeah. go ahead but first yeah. uh gillian hey oh that's me <laughs> Go ahead and make a survival check or, or perception, your choice, depending well, on. I on tried perception and I got a four. So let's try survival's a 22, baby. Good to know. Let's go. Just learned grelp is not grelp. <laughs> next to you, next to you, Chip, uh, Julian just whips out this looks like a, a, like a butterfly pocket knife and he goes, and when it, when it flicks out, it's actually just a comb and he starts, you know, mm. uh, fixing up the. Which with the ruffled yeah. pompadour. It's just a modern day greaser in the middle of this TNT <laughs> campaign. <laughs> I just, I just want to be what can you say, dude? I have a lot of interests. <laughs> just want to be posted up next to him, walking a little, a little campy. My hands are still shaking, but I'm just crunching on these chips. So, Jules, mm -hmm. um, what's up? Uh... <laughs> are you like getting them everywhere? <laughs> yeah, they're, they're like everywhere. Some of them are falling. What's up with the um? What's up with the leather, man? Eh? I didn't catch your name. <laughs> oh, uh, I hold up the chip to his face. Chip. Oh, don't mind if I do. <laughs> Pre no, appreciate no, like, you. I'm, appreciate you. Oh, whatever. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the whole the whole leather thing and the. Whoosh, whoosh. Come, on, what's up, man? What's up with you? You're not digging the threads. I mean, sure, I guess. Um. Little leather's good for you, champ. <laughs> Shines in the moonlight when you're with the babes, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I don't know, it does. Well, when the moon is up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody's a critic. So, uh, the whole angry mob thing, is that like your, uh, that's your thing, bro? He slows his pace a little bit and, and, and leans a little closer. All I'm saying is I don't trust that mad chip. Yeah, I don't trust him either, Jules. No, Chip, hand me another, please. Oh, so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> not as far as I can throw him. That's not far, Jules. Some, there's some, there's some trickery afoot, Jules. That's what I'm saying. Exactly. As you're walking, you can see his knees are, are a little bit, a little bit wobbly as well as he's walking through the forest. But he's trying to keep his chest up. Definitely a foot. Definitely a foot. A foot. I kill a Chip. bug. <laughs> You step on a, uh, a a bug. Feels similar to the bug that you killed before, but <laughs> another down. He takes yeah. He takes another chip. Jules, let's say you and me. This thing goes south. <laughs> it's me and you. Hmm? How about that, Jules? Chip. <laughs> takes it. I just pop one in his mouth. Listen, I gotta. <laughs> I wouldn't mind getting out of here. Feels like I don't belong, but I got to get answers. I hear you, man. I, I got to get answers, and I got to get back at that man, whether he's been wrong or not. Got a little problem with him. <laughs> oh, oh, you uh, heard you macking on his daughter or something? <laughs> <laughs> you could say something like that. <laughs> Until he got a... She's even still alive. Oh, yeah, that's... uh. You know, pop another one in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> he never approved. No, he probably wouldn't. Why? Well, I got your bag if you got mine. If yours is all feathery. Make a persuasion check. Sure, 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 sure. With advantage because of the chips. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 18. Gives you a wink. I trust you. Maybe not the other two, but you got that look in your eyes. You know me. I pop another one in. 
I give him a little the nudge. least trustworthy fucking person. <laughs> I, start, I start walking forward and I'm just like, I'm just piling around with, with Gil while we're walking. Nothing we need to roleplay or anything. But... Hum, hum, hum. The mayor is ready and prime for questioning. Hum, hum, hum. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kind of walking with my hands in my pockets a little bit. I'm like, you know, if you had just been honest with your townspeople, and you know, I don't think you'd be in such a shit situation, actually. Hum, hum. Um, they don't seem to thrust you, uh, thrust to trust you as far as you can throw them. <laughs> you that, know, like... This this man has a way of of convincing me not to do that. <laughs> yeah, but, I mean, you told us pretty easily, <laughs> you know. So, well, it's well, like why, wishing why kind of a, way... upon a star on on the on eleven on eleven stars, eleven stars. Next to each other, like eleven, eleven, <laughs> <laughs> or on your birthday, uh, it's, you course, tell the yeah. wish and it doesn't come true, or it kills you. <laughs> Are you saying he's been like threatening to kill you if you tell them? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, that's yeah, that's serious. Okay, I can I can see where you're coming from now. Um. I guess we'll threaten to kill him back and see how that goes. Uh, <laughs> I would advise much caution. A powerful man like this, well, would not go down so. I mean, we're pretty powerful too, and she kind of like flexes her no muscles. I will throw him <laughs> as hard as I can and see how trustworthy he really is. What? <laughs> is that not now that? No, no, it's trust him as far as... It... Ah, a bug! <laughs> I mean, he was close. <laughs> he almost got it. Okay, and that's it. As you crush that bug... <laughs> Why does that have... I, I, that doesn't show <laughs> that's in every version. That's ominous. Why does it have every I uncrush it! I, you little guy, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you just vanquishing every every insect within the vicinity? You just told me they were evil. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I also told you to get down and crawl at them. I am a living repercussion of your actions. It's <laughs> <laughs> so funny. Oh yeah, what happened with that fucking survival check I made? Am I dying? Am I okay? <laughs> as you crush that bug, or as you are keeping an eye out, Walking through the north woods, uh, and you're listening to the sounds of the creatures who are making their way home or to other places, just living their forest life, and uh, hearing slight conversation behind you and the crunching of chips. Uh, you notice a another rustling in nearby bushes. Just a. Is that all? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Another beast. Are you going off after it? <laughs> I jump at it. It just is like from the bushes in front of you, Gillian. You see one of those small little beetles. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh -oh. With the orange eyes. glow underneath its stomach, illuminating the dirt underneath it. I draw my my whalebone longsword and get on all fours. <laughs> yeah, you do. I'm just, what is the rest? Like the rest of you. Julian this is and very and audible and like yeah. I, I definitely stop in my tracks and observe. I observe I just, Gil. I, I look over at Julian and I'm like, yo, watch this one. Julian and the mayor look puzzled and they stop and watch you get down on all fours. You're eye yeah. to eye now. Don't worry, gang. I'll take care of this one. Yeah, you got it, it buddy. Sure will. <laughs> Another one lands right next to it. Oh, Oh god, I start to back up! <laughs> Chip, he's outnumbered. <laughs> What's he gonna Guys, do? I need, I need the team right now, it's, it's two to one. Another one. Next to it, now there's three in a row. 
Oh no. I am. Um, I'm gonna this try is... and I'm gonna try and take a desperate a desperate swipe. I want to try and get all three of them in one slash. Roll a hit. Okay. So thirteen. Just hits. Just hits. <laughs> Do I roll damage? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm hitting three bugs. How do these bugs have an AC of thirteen and I only? I have don't an AC know, of but that is concerning. Uh, eleven damage. <laughs> Total. Ha! Fear not, team. Right through all three of them as you are in this crouched or, or four crab position. Because they all slice in half. Feral. Which also, uh, in, in, in return, or, or in turn, slices the bushes behind them uh, clean and cut as well. I've Whoa. done good. Yeah, good job. Okay. Good stuff. I mean, and then, and, and you think some wizard will be trouble for me, Gillian Tidestrider? What's behind the bush? <laughs> you guys start to hear a. <laughs> as the bushes start to shake. No! And then. <laughs> Multiple of these small giant oh, fire beetles. Razor. Small oh, giant. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I'm always fucking holding my hair. I was like, not like this, not like this. It's everything's fine. Everything's fine. DMs is, just don't make me go off. I'm okay. I'm it okay. is I'm not okay. flying razors, but it is in fact groups. Four groups of maybe five or six of these flying, flying giant fire beetles. And that's where we're gonna end this session. God damn it. No! <laughs> I just want to I just want to go. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh god. And now the best part where I, Gillian Tidestrider, thank the supporters on Patreon of the show in the high rollers tier. First off, the big motherfucking cheese. I could go for a big motherfucking cheese right now. Yum yum yum. Gulp gulp gulp. I'm just going to read them. Another Shay, CL, Cornier Comet, Curious Cosplayer, Divinator, You Know I Il How the You Know Ialoon, Indy Mindy Nine, J Newell, J R W Y Enjoyer, Jumpiest Venus Thirty Four, King of Ranch, Old Man Skeletal, Reshi Snivy, Riker Kurotu, Salutatian. <laughs> Serene is actually a skeleton. Oh no! There is evil inside you! Walmart man. And your gal pal Valerie V. Thank you so much to Valerie and all of the other supporters of the show. And I fish you all a wonderful day. That's so stupid. That's so literally dumb.